Welcome, fellow Wastelanders. Today, we embark on a journey to discover the essential Fallout 4 mods that promise not only convenience, but also a visual feast. Get ready to witness the Wasteland like never before. The first mod I'd like to introduce to you is Simple Offense Suppression F4SE. This plugin prevents neutral NPCs hit by the player's accidental shots from immediately turning hostile. In urgent combat situations, there might have been instances where you attempted to attack enemies but accidentally targeted settlers, Diamond City Guards, or other neutral NPCs. Even though you had no intention to harm them, it can be quite disconcerting if Neutral NPCs mistakenly perceive you as an enemy and initiate an attack. This plugin proactively prevents such situations, ensuring that even if you accidentally attack a neutral NPC, they won't perceive you as a threat. Next, we have the Fallout 4 Outfit System mod. A much anticipated mod has finally made its way into Fallout 4. This mod allows the player to maintain the visual appearance of modded outfits, even if they aren't actually wearing them. By setting hotkeys through MCM, a real-time menu appears when the hotkey is pressed. Pressing Add Outfit displays a list of the outfits you currently have equipped. You can enter a name for this outfit set, click on the newly generated outfit list on the left, and press Apply. This ensures that no matter what armor you wear, it will visually appear as the outfit set configured in the outfit system. While the Commonwealth's armors provide immersion, in reality, they might be too rugged for your taste. However, acquiring these armors, especially those with legendary options, is another thrill of the game. Often, these armors end up being sold to merchants because their appearance too rough. But now, you don't have to do that anymore. With this mod, you can find fantastic armors and embark on your journeys with ease, of course, while keeping that beautiful appearance intact. Next, I'm delighted to introduce a mod that will upgrade your convenience. I see dead people. This mod adds shader effects to make it easier to locate deceased enemies at night or amidst clutter. Once installed, you'll find the addition of the dead goggles when you log into the game. Wearing these goggles applies shader effects to the deceased, making it more convenient to loot items from their bodies. You can wear these goggles continuously or only when necessary. Removing them will remove the shader effect. If you don't like the appearance of the goggles, you can apply the previously mentioned Fallout 4 outfit system and still use the functionality. Now, you can easily locate bodies hidden in the grass or in the dark of night. Next up is the Modern Warfare Pickup Sound. This mod replaces Fallout 4's default ammo pickup sound with the clean and realistic sound from Modern Warfare Reboot. The modder mentioned that it's based on the MGS ammo pickup sound mod, and if you set the sound effects volume to maximum in the audio settings, you'll hear an even louder sound. Next, we have Fiji Water, IAF included. This mod changes the item Purified Water into a bottle called Fiji Water. It gives the feeling of a bottled water you'd find in convenience stores. It's particularly charming because it's compatible with the immersive animation framework. When you drink water in first-person view, you'll see the Fiji water mesh, adding to the immersion. Next, there's Optimax All-in-One, a big FO4 performance mod. This is a consolidated version of the A Big FO4 Performance mods we introduced earlier. It uses artificial intelligence to generate beautiful and lightweight textures for Fallout 4. The goal of this project, according to the modder, was to improve texture quality while enhancing FPS compared to the vanilla game. Since there were so many mods to download individually, the release of the all-in-one pack now allows for a one-time download. There's a full version and a light version available, but please keep in mind that the file sizes are quite large. I don't have to be careful. I Next, let me introduce a follower mod named Molly. She is a new companion created by the Commonwealth Story Expansion Project team. Molly comes with over 600 lines of human voice dialogue, four fully voiced quests involving tough decisions and moral questions, location and situation, specific comments, and a unique character with a relationship with you. To start Molly's quest line and make her your companion, head to Parkview Apartments. Embark on a more dynamic Commonwealth journey with the distinctive follower, Molly. 
In this segment, I'll be introducing outfits and rifles. First, let's talk about the Vita Psylocke. This outfit is inspired by the Marvel Comics character Psylocke. It gives off a ninja vibe overall, but also has a sense of a suit. The shoulders and thigh lines are well emphasized, giving it an overall sleek and decent look. If you find it appealing, consider adding it to your collection. Or, how about pairing it with the Vertigo Thigh High Boots? These high-quality leather boots that reach up to your thighs will further enhance the beauty of your character. The highlight of these boots is the triple-layered leather wrapped around the ankles, with glimpses of leather belts accentuating the overall quality. Both outfits can be crafted at the chemistry station and support body slide, so feel free to give them a try. Feeling like your outfit is missing something? Well, this time, we've got an amazing weapon to introduce to you. The T6M Spadey's Unreal Rocket Launcher is currently a hot weapon mod over at Texexus. This weapon features a laser musket-style burst-fire launcher, capable of firing multiple rockets or missiles at once. It deals 110 damage per shot in a wide area and can hold up to three rounds, each dealing 70 damage, in a smaller area. It boasts various functionalities, including smart barrels for each type and the ability to rotate a crank-boosted Gatling-style automatic weapon. Experience overwhelming destructive power with the T6M Spadey's Unreal Rocket Launcher. Next, let's talk about Sun's Poses. While it may not be the latest mod, I thought it would be great to introduce it to you. This mod allows you to strike poses just like in the videos with a total of 76 poses available. You can equip the Sun's Pose Ring at the Chemistry Station to use them. There are many diverse and feminine poses and since they are accessible through an item, it's very convenient to use. Enjoy your Fallout adventures with fantastic outfits and striking poses. Thank you for joining us on this journey to enhance convenience and visuals in Fallout 4. Remember, these mods are the key to unlocking a whole new Wasteland experience. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more essential Fallout 4 content. And Patreon sponsorship helps further with video production. Until next time, may your adventures be legendary and your Wasteland be ever thrilling. Stay modded, survivors.